I'm Jolene Mejia reporting for Kids First, and today I will be reviewing Maya the B2 The Honey Games. This animated film had many underlying messages without becoming confusing. Each of the characters had their own strong personalities, which made it more interesting seeing them interact. The plot line was intriguing as well. I enjoyed watching the whole thing. Maya, the main character, who is a bee, has a dream of competing in the Honey Games. One day she has a chance to make her dreams come true, but it will put her entire city at risk. The Empress demands Maya City to give up half of their honey just to donate to the Honey Games. They aren't allowed to participate, but are forced to give up their honey. Maya believes that this is outrageous and challenges the Empress. If Maya wins, she doesn't have to give up any honey, but if she loses, all of the honey will be given over and her city will starve. Maya, played by Coco Jack Gillis, is a well-developed character. Coco can make her voice sound distinctly differently, which is good for Maya, who goes through a lot of emotions. Gillis can sound distressed, guilty, ecstatic, and hopeful. The animation was done really well. The quality is great and all of the little details contribute to make it better. The music also contributed to make the overall film better and to set the mood. My favorite part is when Willie, Maya's best friend, realizes that Violet, another bee who is a bully, is trying to sabotage them. Willie had a slight crush on Violet, which blinded him of all the mean things she was doing to Maya. But now Willie finally realizes what is happening and stands up for Maya. Even through all these hardships, Maya and Willie find it in their hearts to forgive Violet for everything that she has done to them. That is just one of the messages shown in this film. Some more messages shown in the film are that everyone has their special talent, you should believe in yourself, and that no matter how small you are in the world, you can still make a difference. These messages are really important and teaching them can give kids a lot of self-confidence. I love how they were able to incorporate all of these wonderful messages without making the film cheesy. As I have stated, this film is amazing and teaches so many valuable lessons. I rate this film 5 out of 5 stars and recommend it for the ages of 3 to 10. This film came out on DVDs and in theaters, so be sure to check it out. This is Jolene Mejia reporting for Kids First. Thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye. Maybe. <laughs>